this is to demonstrate uh, how to join tarps. Uh, you say we set up stalls in many different configurations. This happens to be an eight-stall barn. So we're going to use two four-stall tarps to show how to join them. You could have two ten-stall barns together, or you could put three three ten-stall setups together to, for a total of 30 stalls, and you would use three ten-stall tarps, but they all join the same. It doesn't matter. So uh, this will demonstrate that. Just set it up there. It'll stay by itself. As I said before, it's always a good idea to put the two end straps on to uh, just in case the wind gets up when you're least expecting it. You can see how the first part tarp is laid in and and just tied at the end. This one's going to roll right over top of the other one and tie down. It's quite simple, really. Now we'll move in a little closer and get a shot of putting the tarp uh, end pipes in and how to join. Okay, so we're just pushing the tarp uh, end pipe in. Go ahead, Chris. We, we did the other one already. And you can see here how the first tarp was tied on already. Now we'll just put our straps on and, and tie the other tarp to the same rafter pipe. So you can tighten these up and use the tension on your uh, straps to, to get the tarp more or less equal distance from that rafter as the first one that was put on. Uh, it doesn't have to be real tight because you'll do the final tensioning from the, the far end. We just tie this back here and we, we don't find it necessary to use a ratchet strap to tighten that because there's only, there's only this much. <laughs> 